Some of us have been involved in sailing all our lives, so sailing and boating, and uh, we just wanted to expand and reintroduce sailing to young people in a structured, organised way. No, it's not expensive at all. The club is only 50 euro a year for membership, and there's 40 members in the club throughout the year. But then when the summer camp comes, about 100 more people come, like if they're on holidays or something. We have a lot of people that volunteer to help us with safety boats. Uh, some of the local fishermen, they you know bring out their boats and they drive around to make sure everyone's okay on the water. Um, I see my friends and I make new friends. Well, if you had your life jacket on and the boat, you would float. Well, you would float and sometimes you hold hands in a circle and then in the middle of the circle it's nice and warm. Um, a lot of people lend boats and like day boats and 420s and a lot of boats that we do them up as well and from doing up the boats we learn how they work better and yeah well the more experienced senior members that have been doing it for a long time teach us and then there's a few like younger ones coming up as well that have learned the skills and they're passing them on and while they're passing on the skills they're learning them better themselves as well. Uh, okay. we, we were in a competition there in Foynes and we were very uh, proud to be in it. It was really tense it was like um, the judge was on the thing and there was a bottle on the thing, you couldn't make it fall. And it was hard. We've been looking regarding funding that um, we've been dealt with favourably by the Mayo Sports Partnership leader, Mehel Forbidden and Gaelic, the Nackel Shell and the Bella Coric Fund. We work under the ISA, Irish Sailing Association guidelines, so they help us with our structure and a programme for our development.